Right, now that we've moved all our work across to our SharePoint server and into your personal folder in that SharePoint server, you need to set up a new site. So let's do that. Site. New site. And let's give this a name. So web dev and SharePoint. So that will be the name of your site. You now need to find the files, so you need to search for your folder. So you may have to scroll a little bit to find it. Yes, I know it was on the screen before, but I just want to demonstrate. You may have to scroll down until you find this Waverley Christian College one. It just says Waverley Christian College. Don't be, don't accidentally go into the OneDrive Waverley Christian College. Just Waverley Christian College. You need to find for yourself um, the web development and you need to open up your folder. All right, so I've just picked a student here, and you're going to select that folder. That's the site set up. So now that's all your work, and I'm going to click Save. And uh, you won't get that error. <clears throat> it's only because I've got other shares. And then you will see your work. All right, you should all see a file called welcome.html because I've put that there into all of the folders. You should be able to double click on that and open it up. And there it is. <clears throat> and if you do right click, open in browser, pick your browser and open it up, it should work. So if you've done everything correctly, there, that's what's going to happen for you. Now, just need to say a few other things in terms of how you use this. All your files must be here. If they're not here, then you need to copy them to the SharePoint server. That's the only place you work. Never do a file open. Never, never, never use file open. If it's not here, then you're going to have to fix it. Once you build a folder to work in, Keep things in that folder. Don't shuffle them around, otherwise it won't work. If you've got pictures that you want to work with, they must be somewhere in this folder or a subfolder. Subfolders are fine. All right. And when you do a save, let's say I've made myself a new page. HTML page. Create. I want to save this as the nothing page file. Sure, you go here to save as. <clears throat> you must be in the right folder. Check up here that it is your folder you're going to. If not, make sure you go to the site root and then save it. I'm going to save that as nothing, the name of the file. All right. And if all works correctly, you should see that that file appears over here. Or if it was in a subfolder, it would appear in the subfolder over here. So you need to make sure that that's always happening. Okay, um, that's it. Good. Make it so.